So there's a whole bunch of stuff that leads up to this that I won't share because it will take way too long. But um, I, after like all of yesterday, I right before service went into the cabin and um, it was just me in there and I just kind of was like laying down on the floor. I just felt like the Holy Spirit just inviting me to just be with him. And so I'm laying on the floor and I just begin to weep and it's like, I could just feel him so close, but it was also like uh, my heart was just so like lovesick for him. Like I just kept saying over and over, like, Jesus, just come back. Like, I just miss you. I just want you here. And I'm just saying that to him over and over. And I just begin to, it's like he's putting the words in my mouth at the time. And it's like, I'm like, I'll go for you, Jesus. I'll go, I'll go. I'll go to the nations. I'll go wherever you want me to go. And that's not words that have really come out of my mouth before. And um, and I'm like, so I'm just saying all this to him, just weeping in his presence. And it really messed me up. But then last night after the service is over and everyone's just kind of, you know, and I'm just sitting in the, I, I I felt him invite me again. I sit down in this chair over here and, um, I just felt, I I couldn't see his face, but I just knew he was like right in front of me. He like knelt down right in front of me, just like I'm on my knees and he's just right there with me. I could feel him there and he just grabs my hands and it's like, we're just there together. And then he like prompts me to take my shoes off and I'm like, okay. And he's like, I want, I want to wash your feet. So he begins to just wash my feet and I'm just weeping before him, just going, why, why do you want to do this? And he, he just says, I'm anointing you. And I'm like, for what? And he's for service. And so I don't know like what exactly that means or looks like, but it kind of messed me up. (laughs) 